In this layout, I have no viewports. To create a viewport, I would go to the View tab, and on the Viewports panel, choose New. From the dialog box, I want a single viewport, and I'm going to draw this by defining its two corners, and it creates the viewport with my view into model space zoomed to show all of the entities. To work with this viewport, first I'm going to zoom in on my layout, and then I'm going to double click inside the viewport to activate it. I now have model space active inside the viewport, so I can zoom in uh, using my regular model space tools, and I'm going to center the section view in the viewport and now I need to scale it for its plot scale. I'll go down here to the status bar and I have my plot viewport scale and in this case I want the scale to be half inch equals one foot. Also I'll use my pan command to get it centered in the viewport the way I want it to show up on the printed page. Lastly I'm going to lock the viewport so that the scale can't be accidentally changed. When I create a viewport, it shows up with black lines that define its edges. I don't want these lines to be printed uh, on my layout, so I want to make sure that the, that the layouts all exist on the viewport layer and I've turned off printing for the viewport layer. So I'm going to click on the edge of this viewport and I'm going to change its location to the viewport layer. Next I'm going to look at my layers property box and here's my viewport layers. Going across I'm going to make sure that the viewports will not print but I want them to remain visible so that I can see where the edges of my viewports are. I can not only control the scale and what objects are viewed in a viewport, I can control the visibility of layers and also layer properties. As an example, here I have the floor plan of this small cabin. I'm going to look at a new layout that has a viewport showing a closer view of the kitchen and bath. In this particular viewport, I want to turn off the dimensions so that they aren't visible. To do this, I would double click inside the viewport to choose this specific viewport. I'm going to access my uh, layer manager and all of the dimensions in this drawing are on the dimension layer. I'll activate that so that I can go over here and look and here are controls that go with um, just viewports. So I can freeze the dimension layer in this specific viewport. If I clicked it over here under new it would freeze the dimension layer in all new viewports that I create. I could also, depending on the layer I was working with, change the, view, uh, the layer color or the line type or the line weight in each individual viewport. I'll go ahead and close this and now you see that the dimension layer has been turned off and the dimensions are no longer visible in this viewport. But if I go back to my floor plan, in this viewport all the dimensions are still visible. 